Hey guys, this is going to be a quick video on how to make an ambient guitar in FL Studio. Uh, you can use either a guitar or a guitar VST like shreddage or electricity. So let's get started. Uh, we'll open up contact. Uh, contact. Open up shreddage. Now, originally, initially it has a mono track. But you can make this stereo by clicking here. Now, if you don't have a stereo option or you're not recording stereo, you can simply go to open up guitar rig, go to components, cabinets, match cabinet, and put it all the way to air. And you still get a stereo sound but since it already has one we don't need this okay put the stereo on and make sure when you're doing stereo put a left right the right channel in as well okay now let's go to dynamics put in volume pedal <clears throat> and this is where it all is going to be controlled to get that uh, slow attack for the guitar sound you need delay and echo. Use delay man instead of twin delay because with delay man, it has this depth um, option where uh, it creates a chorus sound. So the sound makes, it detunes the sound a little bit in order to make the sounds more unique. So we put the depth up to the 20% range and put the feedback we need a lot of feedback and like the 70 between 70 to 7 80 percent range so i'm gonna put it like to 75. put the dry wet to halfway and that's would be all to to it and go to slot two and use a reverb plugin uh tal reverb is a pretty good one um, i like the results with this one it's a free plugin so you don't have to worry about that so we put the wet signal all the way, like around here, middle way. And let's see how this sounds. Pretty nice. So we're gonna make a, let's make an E chord, E uh, major chord. So it's E then B and another E, G, B, E. I'll put this here. Okay, so now for the guitar rig, we'll put this down to zero well, and open this up. Put the minimum volume to negative 75. Then press the play button. Let make this longer. So. Now to automate this, you just click on this and then go to view, or wait, uh, tools, go last tweak and press create automation clip. And you can see it says guitar rig insert one volume pedal. And you just press create automation clip. And voila, you can use this control the volume pedal in the song. So I hope this will be help is helpful for you. And We'll see how it sounds in a song.